Hey skiers, it's Bob with SkiEssentials.com. Welcome to our 2023 ski test. We've got a Rosignol Experience 82 Ti for you today. It's a carryover model for 2023. Uh, so if you missed out on your chance and really liked the sounds of this last year, you're gonna get another crack at it this year. Uh, and that's great news for all mountain skiers who kind of lean more towards the front side aspect. Uh, at 82 millimeters underfoot, we're certainly in the narrow side of all mountain, not quite at the, uh, you know, not quite in the front side category, mostly because of like the construction and shaping of these skis, but you can really blur or blend whatever line you choose to put this side on, whatever side of the line you choose to put the ski on. Uh, certainly has a rugged construction, uh, very helpful for carving those clean and round turns. We start with a poplar wood core, two sheets of metal, fiberglass laminate, so it's going to be strong, stable, and that fiberglass does have a good energetic feel to it. Also get drive tip solution here, so by putting stiffer material filtering into a visco uh, layer here in the forebody of the ski, it definitely harnesses those vibrations and then puts them through that visco filter, really kind of gets rid of them, giving the ski a very smooth turn initiation phase. Uh, and that filters through all the way, uh, you know, through the rest of the ski to the tail. So nice, long, effective edge on this ski, super smooth, uh, very responsive. And we see kind of this tail shape and how it bumps out at the end. Uh, it really likes to hold on to that turn until the very end, giving you excellent energy and rebound into the next carve. Uh, but really well-rounded ski, you know, even though it's on the narrow side, it does have that off-trail capability, but most people are gonna be using this ski uh, in a on-piste and inbounds format most of the time. This is the 176 and we get a 16 meter turn radius, uh, which is pretty short for all mountain. Definitely we're seeing kind of more of that trend towards that 15 to 16 meter radius uh, in that front side ski. So this kind of leans that way uh, in that realm. So really prefers to be up on edge and making those clean round turns. Uh, but very quick edge to edge as well. Like if you wanna take this thing into the bumps uh, or the trees, if there's not a ton of fresh snow, uh, I think this is a, a fantastic option for that. You can really get that from edge to edge uh, super quick and very, very easy to maneuver. Nice camber underfoot on this ski. You know, we're seeing that nice bounce built in uh, and then pretty wit, I would call it width appropriate rocker. Uh, so starting down about here, we do see an end to that sidewall laminate and then that drive tip does go up in more of a cap format here. Um, but we do see that kind of all mountain rocker shape, you know, not really for flotation through powder, more for turn initiation and smoothness. Uh, and I'd say the exact same uh, theory goes for the tail as well, where it's not really a playful oriented rocker profile. It's more like uh, an ease of use or a friendliness aspect to it. So most of the business of this ski is done in the middle of those in between the rockers of this ski and, you know, really helps get that camber alive and kicking and get you into the next turn. Uh, and that's really what this thing's all about. Super easy to get on edge and loves to be ridden right through the, the whole radius of that turn. Um, but that's it, you know, great ski. We're psyched to see it back. Uh, this is a Rosignol Experience 82 Ti. Check this thing out at skiessentials.com and we'll see you out there on the hill. Bye.